Hi guys, it's uh, Inam Gafur again with the, the Samsung Galaxy S2. Uh, this one's got the new leaked uh, ICS ROM on it. Uh, if I just show you what it is, if I can just find settings. There you go. Whoops. We'll go down to about. There you go. Just bring that in so you can see that. It's got the new XXLP2 build for ice cream sandwich. Um, this is a newly leaked ROM, um, the official one from Samsung. It's uh, recently been leaked. Okay, uh, I showed you in my last video on how to install this on the device, but that wipes any previous route that you did on the on the device. So, what I'm going to do is show you in this video how to uh, root the device again. So we'll just switch it off. This device isn't rooted uh, since we did the install. So we'll just switch off. Uh, the phone and then we'll go into download mode and the way we do that is press volume down power and then the home button all together simultaneously until the phone gets into download mode as you can see here where it gives us a warning saying we're going into download mode to accept the warning we press volume up and that's got us into download mode there so what we're going to do is just plug the phone into the into the computer by the USB lead. Um, there you go. And then uh, we'll move over to the computer. You can see uh, I've got the, the CF root file um, on the desktop of my computer. Um, I'll put a link in the description of where you can download this from. Um, so it's a tar file, dot tar file extension. Uh, so first of all what you need to do is fire up Odin again I'll put a link in the description of where you can download this from okay um, you got the yellow box there just showing that the phone is connected to the computer um, what you need to do is ensure that only in this options top left option section only auto reboot and reset time are ticked all of the tick boxes need to be blank and empty what you need to do is on the right hand side tick next to where it says PDA and then hit the PDA button and once that loads the browser window navigate to where you put the .tar file so if you navigate to where you put the tar file which uh, there we go select it and then hit open and then you're set uh, you just hit start and then it'll flash across here and then the phone will reboot if it's gone successfully this, that will turn green as it does and says pass on the phone you can see it's turned itself off and it's rebooting you've got the yellow triangle just symbolizing that it has indeed been rooted we're done with uh, Odin now so we can get that closed down Once it gets to this stage, sometimes it can take maybe a minute to load up, but it, just leave it be. It maybe takes about um, 30 seconds to a minute or so. Okay, you can see, so it's booted up into the normal screen. Just get that unlocked. I'm just punching my pin. Okay, so there we go. Now, if we go, whoops, if we go into the applications, we should see. There you go, you can see the super user app and the CWM app. Again, just symbolizing that the phone is now rooted. There you go. And that's how easily you root uh, your Samsung Galaxy S2, which has now got the leaked uh, ICS, so the ice cream sandwich f Android 4.0.3 um, operating system on it. Uh, again, I should just mention this is a, a leaked operating system, so it's uh, Samsung hasn't officially uh, unveiled it yet, but it's an official leak, so um, that's how you root the Samsung Galaxy S2. Any questions or comments, just put them in the comment section below. Hit subscribe from the button up top there, uh, just to check out some of my forthcoming videos. It doesn't cost you anything, it's free, and you can keep in touch. 
see what I'm up to. Um, thanks for watching and goodbye.